We all tend to walk through life thinking about the past, worrying about the future. Will it happen? Will everything be okay? You know, what happened in the past and why did it happen? Why did that person say that in that way? Why did that experience take place? Why did I feel the way that I feel and or the way that I felt? And then in the future, we're so worried about, will everything work out the way it needs to? Will everything be okay? We get ourselves into such a state of panic that we forget to be in the now. And you know what, friends? Now is all that matters. Nothing else matters except right here, right now, in this moment. We can't just step out of our door and turn left and suddenly walk towards the past and go and have a re-experience or, you know, have a have a, a do-over. We can't do that. Just as we can't walk out of our door, turn right and step into the future and get everything all planned and ready and laid out for us so that when we actually get there to experience that everything is perfect, it doesn't work like that. The only thing that we have is this moment right here and right now. I know it's not easy being in the now. I know it's not easy to stay present. It requires a lot of focused attention. It requires a lot of control on your part to stay in the here and now and to not allow yourself to get distracted or to get, you know, deviated off the path of staying present and staying in the now. We need to learn how to be only focused on what is happening right now. We need to learn how to only to to fully immerse ourselves in whatever it is that we're dealing with in this space, in this moment. You know, anything that's for later, for tomorrow, for next week or for next month, it can wait. Yes, there is a certain amount of planning that needs to take place, but there's also a certain amount of trust that needs to take place. And we spend so much time planning and being in the future or being in the past that we're actually forgetting to live. We're actually forgetting to experience life as we have it, as we are right here and right now. Think about eating a meal. While we're eating a meal, we're we're immediately pondering our day that has already taken place, or we're pondering the day that's about to happen, or events that are, are coming up. We don't actually fully immerse ourselves in eating food, feeling this, the, the textures, feeling the sensations, you know, chewing, mindfully chewing, mindfully accepting nourishment into your body and you know swallowing it and allowing it to do whatever it needs to we're so focused on other things past or future that we actually are not present in our own situations i look at relationships um that that people have with each other most of the problems we have in relationships are communication and not because we're not talking to each other but because we're not in this moment right here right now with each other appreciating enjoying and just being together there's so much judgment there's so much conditions there's so much i will only love you when you have done a b and c or i will love you more once you have achieved x y and z why not just be happy with each other in this space so friends i want to urge you to to rethink to relook at your life your situation and your circumstances and almost just remind yourself every couple of minutes am i being in the now am i focusing on right here right now or am i allowing myself to be distracted am i allowing myself to drift into the past or to drift into the future stay in this now stay in this moment and and just keep bringing yourself back to center and i promise you you will achieve more you will be happier you will be more successful and you will have a better sense of peace a better sense of joy and a better sense of happiness in your heart and that is what matters most